Well, to all you Wichita State Shocker fans, just go ahead right now and pound your chest and why not take a bow, huh? Your team remains unbeaten, the only one left standing. And I can only hope now, folks, the Syracuse loss will silence all those naysayers who keep just chirping out there about the Shocker's soft schedule. It's not the best, we all know that, but look at who some of the big BCS schools are playing. How about Boston College, RPI in the 190s, goes into the Mammoth Building in Syracuse, takes down the mighty number one previously unbeaten Orange. We watched the ragtag bunch from Texas Tech, RPI over 100. They nearly stormed the court against Kansas. Jayhawks got lucky and they squeaked out a win. Well, you know what? You can have a team full of McDonald All-Americans. You can have multiple lottery picks and a blue blood reputation. But, hey, teams like Boston and College, Wichita State, they don't give a rip. The players really are college students. They go to class. They actually study. And most of them graduate. It's amazing in itself. Sports Illustrated just hit the newsstands with a featured story on the Shockers. They're right there on the cover for the whole America to see. There isn't a team more deserving or a fan base. The Shockers are the biggest sports story in Kansas. They have been all season. KU and K-State won't play them. The Jayhawk and Wildcat fan bases don't like them. And now all of America knows why. 28 and zero. Perfect. It's worth repeating, folks. Wichita State, the only unbeaten team in college basketball. Amen. That's Jack Smack.